welcome back. You know, I decided that four losses in a row wasn't enough, so we're going to learn something more today. We're going to see uh, just what we can learn about this game. Or if we can, like, not finish completely dead last, that'd be pretty great. I understand we're tied for dead last, but a win would really help us out in that regard. A loss would just help us um, with regard to if there's ever an under X rated event that only low rated players can play. Having a low rating could be beneficial, but that's really not the goal. I'd like to win a game. We had a couple okay games. Uh oh. Um, we've got a fast mover on our hands. Wait, now if I do this, do I get wrecked? I don't think so. Well, that was fun. I think I'm okay, though. Ha! <laughs> I get triple jumped. Oh, that was exciting. Alright, so we're even, somehow. Don't ask. Um... I suppose he's gonna go directly there, right? Wait, oh, I must capture. God damn it. I always think that there's something that's going to get me out of all those situations, and there just rarely is. <laughs> okay, well, that was special. And a half. I wonder what uh, opponent I'm playing against. Not that knowing helps me, but um, I am curious, for sure. There we go. Can't never take this down. Unless you just play a good move. And then I'm hosed. Um, yeah, okay, we can concede that. That was fun. That was just an 1800. That was not a master. We did get an opponent. Um, but I think these two 1500 question mark dudes must be playing each other. And the tournament pairing system would love to give me a pairing, so. I think I can still get the, well, yeah, no, I'd get the award for most consistent results so far, if there were such a thing. Because I don't think anybody's won all their games. Yeah, so, ah, tough luck for bumper balloon cars. Um. I wonder what MF stands for. Like, I can get that in French this would be International Master. Um, that couldn't possibly be, could it? A title for being an expert in this particular flavor of the game? I'd click on the name, but that won't take me to the profile. Even this doesn't tell me what the heck FMID. I still don't understand what that means, but. Um, no, I guess that must be the Federation. Uh, the master title for the Federation of International Drafts. drafts. Um, pardon me when I miss, mix that up. I apologize, because it must be annoying some people. I'm doing my best, but obviously I'm kind of not quite as talented as these fellows here. I've got quite a ways to go. Skilled would be the word I was looking for. Talent would imply that people are just naturally good at this. Um, obviously it's a skill that's developed over time. Uh, as far as I know, there are no shortcuts to actually becoming a master of this game. 
Um, all right, so we'll exchange here right away. Because why not? What's the worst that could happen? There's no way I could lose this guy, right? Am I right? We'll find out. Stay tuned. <laughs> uh, I am so incorrect. All right, so we'll go here instead. There's no way we could lose this guy. All right, I'll just vacate the center. No big deal. So how come he can do that? Pretty much with impunity. And yet when I try to do similar things, I get my butt kicked. I'm going to keep these guys connected for a while. I'm going to keep the first rank together. And the 5, 10, and 15 together. Uh, 6 and 16 together, I guess. Um... Oh, I have a forced capture. That is to say, I have a capture. Um, fine. I'm at a space deficit on both flanks, which bamboozles and flusters me. Um, I can only hope that my opponent has overextended. Damn it! I cannot... I figured my guy was defended. I'm just stupid. How could I miss that? Like, I fully intended to capture the other direction. And... Yeah. Um, I'm not particularly smart, I guess. Well, like I said earlier today, it would probably help if I just started with the base game and then tried to learn this on top of it. Instead of trying to learn everything all at once, which is probably quite the burden. Um, but that's not how generally I try to do things on this channel. So and Generally, I take the path of greatest adversity. Um, and I'm not sure why, other than there's some kind of humor in trying things and having no idea what you're doing. So if they play this, I do have this move. Well, oh, I'm sorry. No, I have. I'm forced to capture. If they do that, I can't draw the arrow to go through that. But um, yeah, I'd have a forced capture if they did that. So it doesn't actually benefit them, but um, they could have forced my hand. I probably should not move my corner man. It seems horribly weakening, but I'm just not sure what to attempt here. Okay, this is forced, this is forced, this is forced. All intentional. Um, at the time that I made each move, I saw it was the only legal move. And to that extent, I intended to make those moves. Um, calling it that sort of play strategic would be a bit above and beyond me. Um, okay. Actually, these guys on the second rank are pretty well connected, aren't they? Um, he's shooting for my corner. I really don't know what to do about it. Um, I 
Because all these natural reactions don't seem to make much sense. I guess what I'm learning over time, though, is it's okay to leave your guys all on the flank. The center is amply well defended. Um, so... With that heuristic in mind, maybe I can find a good move or two. Um, wait, I could play this guy up. Why don't I do that? If I do this, he has to capture here. Seems okay for me. He is going to find this capture, right? Yeah. <sighs> I kind of wish I could get a guy tucked back in the corner, but that's not so simple. Um, this is forced. Okay. I don't understand the point of that move. I really don't understand the point of his moves here. So I'm going to reconnect my guys by way of this sacrifice. I think I'm actually playing okay. I might actually win a game where my opponent just accidentally drops all of his men. So this is... Oh wait, so I have to take here have to capture this way. Right, and this is still okay. This is forced. Um... Okay, so this is the sacrifice I'm targeting. So I've protected my flank. And this flank seems safe. Alright. Um... So we'll just wait for me to botch this somehow. Though admittedly, I don't see how. Um... This seems scary. I've lost on time because there is no increment. Well, that was almost a win. Good gravy, this game's difficult. Um, all right. That was not bad. Could have gone better. It's funny to see other people complaining about not knowing what they're doing. Um, <laughs> uh, 
Uh, I don't know what I'm doing much more than you don't know what you're doing. All right, we'll do this. This seems like a thing, ish maybe. Wait, right, did I lose a guy again? Is this guy dropping somehow? Questions you should ask before you move. Um, okay, I'm going back this way. I think I've protected him. Maybe. Maybe not. I can't really tell. Um... Can I go here? This seems super dangerous. Um, I think this is my safest move? Question mark? Like, I see this, all three guys um, set up for some sort of windmill thing. But I don't see an activator for the windmill. Okay. Right. So I'm down just one. That's okay. Excelsior. Ever onward shall we march. Okay. Oh god. Well, we lost. Yeah, I'm not even going to try to hold that. Well played. That was fun. Seven in a row. Um, so the only reason somebody could say they don't know what they're doing. Um, oh, come on. He's in sixth place. Um, call that seven. I'm not sandbagging. I just have never played this game before. Um, this is pretty great. Kudos to the people who actually figure out how to play this monstrosity of a game. Because it seems much too complex for any mortal mind to manage. Um, I guess it's just a matter of pattern recognition, no? Here, let's play this one. Last time I played the other guy to... Um, let's see, this is 40... 39? Last time I played the other dude to 39. Um, wow. Yeah, no, that actually exerts a ton of influence, doesn't it? Okay. Uh, let's play this forward, I guess. Um, I can do this, right? This seems like a not terrible move. Um, oh, hang on. We might have a chance against this fellow. We might have a chance. I never realized just how scary those dudes are. Um, on 21 and 22. Or whatever that is. 21 and... 26? I can't tell. I'm trying to number the squares. There's just too many of them to keep track of them all. Alright, so... I'm just going to engage in this kind of lance on this side of the board and on this side and see if something positive can happen. Um,
It's a good thing that I have legal moves highlighted, or I probably wouldn't find half of them. Um, so, I could sack this, right? This is safe ish. This is the sort of thing where there really should be a combination to help me somewhere. It's a grave travesty that there is not. Oh, here's a combination. I found one. All right. King me. <laughs> it actually applies in this game. All right, so. Um... Like, it feels like I should have a dude somewhere in the center. Uh, wow. Holy moly, if there were a combination, it would be such a great combination. But I don't think there is one. I can sack a dude. I'd be losing it, though. Um... Let's play one dude to the center. And try not to sacrifice the guys accidentally. Oh my goodness. This is stressful. So I've got these guys connected. So hopefully there's no shot there. Um, if there ever is a shot, it's going to be a super painful combination. Wait, why have I not just linked this up? Is there some travesty awaiting me if I do that? Why would I do that when I can do this? This seems more sensible and sets that up. Um, it feels like everything's just waiting to die in that sort of situation somehow. I've seen so many horrific things occur in similar positions. I'm going to play this to try to hold my stuff together. Here's the ballsy move. Obvious threat is obvious, but what do you do about it? It's not like this is a very good option. And while you could play this forward this way, um, I'm preparing something like this. I feel like my opponent just left their positions as wide open as possible accidentally. Right, so we'll execute on the plan, I suppose. So set up a cannon for this direction and then just move this in and promote. Um, Now, I don't know what to do once I have the king. That's going to be an adventure in its own right. But hopefully, uh, I'll be able to manage it somehow. 
Okay. Ah, uh, so close and so far. If this... Okay, what? What's that? The sacrifice is no good, so... I have 36 seconds to figure out this end game, but it can't be too bad, right? I can actually win a game of drafts, maybe. Maybe once in my life I can win a game. Okay, I should take here. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, just kidding about the winning a game part. That's not happening. Funny, huh? Alright. I can promote again, maybe. I think I have the opposition. I think. If not, I'm boned, but um yeah, I don't. Oh, that's unfortunate. That is super unfortunate. Um All right, screw it. Making a break for it. Making a break. Well, I almost won a game. Damn it! <laughs> Alright, that's eight in a row. Uh, well? Ooh. That sucks. We almost had it. It was close. I miss having my engine analysis pointing out. I mean, yes, with chess, I've reached a point with engine analysis that I understand what advice to ignore. And I think I could apply a similar heuristic to drafts. I think I could eventually somehow figure out what advice is meaningful or valuable to me um, and what I can just safely ignore. But um, obviously playing against real human opponents and getting real human advice is probably most valuable to me at this point. Wait, so... Oh, I'm sorry. There was a resignation on the top board there. No, there's not. Those arrows with the rating up and rating down indicate rating gain and loss throughout the event. As opposed to a finished result. Obviously this capture, right? No? Oh, I'm sorry. Maybe it's not legal. Um, oh, I'm sorry. The king must capture if it may. Oh, boy. So there's a forced capture there. And um, I'm not sure if this endgame, uh, what it's expected result should be. I really don't know. Oh, there it is. Yeah, you can't line up like that. But still, I wonder if there is any way to defend that. I'm gonna guess no, but you never know. I wonder if I have the lowest rating on the site.
If not, I'm sure aiming for it. Um, this tournament's not giving me a pairing now, is it? How's everybody else doing? Got bumper balloon cars. Still in first. On a nice winning streak. Alright. I go second. I knew that. Alright. So I'm going to try that as well. Doing a fully symmetrical opening makes me nervous. Um, this is an even exchange, right? I have not yet lost. There are still more moves in this game. Moves in which I can manage to lose more things. But at least for the moment, I've not yet lost. Oh, shit. Oh, uh, give it time. We're going to win this, guys. Somehow. Unless we're playing against a good player, in which case we're just going to die. <laughs> um, we're playing a good player. He's not letting me get back to 21. 26 rather. What? Okay, that's confusing. Why would you do that? Not that I understand, like, the opening strategy of this game. Or even much of the tactics, but um, it seems like there was a lot that could have been played a lot differently there. Okay, I'm guessing that was deliberate? That he allowed me to almost have a shot? I don't understand why you do that, but there must be some justification. Part of that might be trying to speed up the tournament. Um, that's not good. Alright. Um, do I have nothing here? I got nothing. You got it, man. Well played. <sighs> so that's slightly discouraging. Although he's a master, so it makes sense that he understands what's going on to a degree that I completely don't. Um... Perhaps trying to play for the flanks of the board might be the riskiest strategy. I'm not really sure. Alright, here we go. We're going for 26. 26 or bust. <laughs> um... Also, 21 or bust. I guess what I'm saying is that I'm going to bust. But I'll do it spectacularly. Okay. Well... I had that planned, maybe. Not really. Oh, thank goodness the combination ends there. I had all of that planned. It was brilliant ish. Okay, so. 
I guess I played okay. Screw this. We're going to connect these dudes together. Make the closest thing we can resembling a fortress. And now what? Something like this, I think? So this is still intended-ish. Um, this is weird. Wait, wait, wait. Gotta support this dude. If I'm gonna sacrifice this ever, I can't just leave this guy hanging. I can't just leave my 11 hanging in order to sacrifice on 16. Um, well, I'm just waiting for some kind of silly move to happen. Um... Okay, so we connect this so that... Well, now I'm dropping this, unfortunately. Um, yeah, no, I just let him promote on three. Well, I can recapture after the promotion, so it's not devastating. It's not what I was aiming for. Um, wait, can I step forward here? Only at some risk. Um, what else can I consider? Um, I could consider this. Seems dangerous. Yeah, we're not doing that. Um, Here, let's just take care of the easy combination. Because he's not dropping this anymore. Um, like, he's no longer potentially playing that and dropping a promotion, so... Uh, we'll just use this to defend the rank until he makes some useful move. Alright, I have to take that, right? There's no. There's no capture here. Just feels like there should be a capture. Um My everything is hanging. This feels slightly safer. And that there's no. Okay, so I have to take this. You can capture here, I can recapture. Um. That's scary. I have no time to think anymore. feels like everything is hanging. I still don't see a way out. I am playing with fire. Let's get burned. Where's the shot? Here's the shot. Yep, he found it. 
Well spotted, sir. And now I get like... Oh wait. Just kidding. I had that all planned. All oh, that was planned. That was my master plan. Um, good luck to me figuring out the combination from here. No doubt there's some kind of super amazing mega combination that just liquidates everything. Um, but I don't need such a thing. I can just decide things one at a time. Um, I can do this, right? I have a capture. No, I don't. Oh, they don't move that way. That's the deal. That's the deal. Alright, I must capture. Oh, that was short-lived. Corner, sir. Or not. All right. Nice. We planned that one out too. Maybe. Okay. Here we go. Found a position we can't lose. Oh my goodness, we won a game, guys. We are no longer in last. We are in 14th place. <sighs> well. Uh, we clearly played somebody who's never played that variant before. Um, uh, that was exciting. Jiminy Cricket, that was super exciting. I beat a player who played their first game of this. Um, and only mostly due to luck. Um, there was some degree of skill involved, but let's be honest. Um, luck never hurts. And occasionally does help. Bad luck hurts, I suppose, but... Do we have any of that? Nah. <laughs> All my losses are due to lack of skill. And my wins... We'll say are... We'll just credit those to luck. Until I manage to actually, like, develop some skill in this game. Huh. <laughs> Well, it seems... Wow, that was quite a combination. So I should be careful about advancing my dudes beyond the second row. This is what I'm figuring out. That on the second rank, you can only be captured diagonally. Um, it's once you start moving beyond the second rank that things get scary. Oh, that's a useful pinch. Jeez. I mean, he was already up a man, but now he's going to be up a lot more. And a king. That's pretty nice. All right, we're all waiting in the lobby for the next pairing. I think everybody's played everybody, basically. Although I don't remember playing Thor Silver, I probably have. I just probably have blocked that out of my memory. Um, that said, we have the white men, so there's a decent chance that I've played this opponent before. Because if I'm seeing any pattern, which I think I am, um, the stronger player is given the white pieces in the first game between any two players. So either I'm seeing a pattern or I'm just imagining it. 
but either way, it seems pretty real. That in any contest, um, uh, the white men are given to the higher rated player first. <laughs> so I want to protect that spot, don't I? So now I can do this. Of course, if they just move forward, I can no longer do that without having protected this spot. What? Okay. Um. I'm confused. I'm confused. Show me what's going on. Oh my god. Um, nicely done. Well played. Um, I should probably concede after that beautiful maneuver, but eh. conceding's for suckers. We'll fight this out to the last man. Or die pretty quickly. Which is much more likely to occur. This fellow is moving super quickly, so he probably knows what he's doing. We'll just assume. I'm moving quickly because I'm flustered. Oh. Well, that's clever. All right. I got thoroughly outflanked there. <sighs> so now what? What if I just say no? No, we're not going to exchange there. We've done that a thousand times. They're going to do something different this time. We're going to find a different way to lose. Um, okay. I have to capture. This is confusing, is it not? Um... I think this is safe. I hope this is safe. Or I am screwed. That seems okay. Well, that was exciting. Um, we're going to try to just cover both flanks. Just move all the guys to the side of the board, and hopefully good things happen. So there's the threat. Fairly obvious. Although I don't know what black should do about it. Also, moving your guy to this center square, what's this, 48, 38, 28? This 28 can't be too safe. All right, but see, now, well, 
I'm not sure if that's best. Let's take your first. Oh. Oh my goodness. Funny how that worked out. I think it was forced either way. I just picked the worst continuation because I don't know what I'm doing. Um. Yeah, that's no good. Whatever. We found a different way to lose that time. So that's an achievement. Yeah, I do see the question. Uh, is five minutes the longest uh, friction tournament out there? Yeah. Because, um, well, at least at this point, I no longer have the most consistent performance award. If there were such a thing. Some players have been more consistent. Can I do this? Is this just lost somehow? Okay, so I lost a man. I'm always learning new things. Always playing new mistakes. Mistakes are all there, just waiting to be played. There's a strange geometry between these pieces, no? Oh wait, we found an opponent who's moving slower than we are. So maybe there's a chance that I might confuse them. Not a very good chance, but maybe there's one. What? Oh, there it is. The double jump. Expertly executed. Well, we set up the same thing. He's obviously not going to fall for it, but um, we can attempt it anyway. This doesn't even set up a real threat. I'm just tilting more than anything else here. Um, huh? It doesn't quite work out. Oh, very nicely done. Very nicely done. So... I might still have... no, I don't have the lowest performance rating. <laughs> I forgot three moves with the king. Has to be followed um, by a peace move. Oh! Oh, that's brutal. I did read that in the rules. That if you move the king too many times, then you have to move a piece. And I don't know if that's just by custom or how that works out in terms of how the rules are codified. Um, but... It 
it's funny when the experts of the game forget the rules. It's how you know you have a really solid game. <laughs> And even your greatest proponents of your game can't manage to remember all the rules. Um, hmm. Well, that's not fishy at all. It's not fishy in the least. Oh my goodness. Well, this is just going to get more and more tense until I make a mistake. I would say until one of us makes a mistake, but let's be real. We know who that's going to be. Ten by ten boards. Even made your own ten by ten board. Oh, that's nice. I hear there's some chess variants that can be played on ten by ten. Hmm. Moving this seems super suspicious or suspect. Um. But I'm not seeing the shot, so we're going to do it. We're going to lose a new way each time until we run out of new ways to lose. And they invent a new game, and then we manage to lose that one. Alright, so... I think I've got that covered. This seems super suspect, but I don't see a way in. So forward I march. I really don't have lots of ways to set up a combination without moving my dudes. Um, well, we're going to do the obvious thing for lack of being creative. It seems not terrible. Oh, it's actually a lot better than I thought it was. Um. Oh, that could have been a lot worse. I made a thing happen. That was cool. Um... <laughs> this is dubious as all heck. Putting all my guys in the same line, but wait. He doesn't have a way to double jump here, so I'm fine. Ish. Hmm. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. So... I don't want to let this um, be a prime target, so we're going to protect that. And then move forward. <sighs> so... Is 
seems like this is my only way forward, so I'm doing it. Um, I'd really like this piece to be there. I'm uh, two spaces away, but really, it might as well be all the way across the board. But I am up to men. I might have a chance of not blowing everything. Well, this was the plan. Let's stick with it. Actually, I should have put this guy in front, shouldn't I? Um... All right, everything's under control-ish. Not really. Let's pretend. Let's pretend things are okay. Nobody panic. All right, so here's the plan. It actually seems not terrible. Because I've got these both covered, so all I need to do is just march this way and just keep running, 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 and hopefully this works out. Oh my goodness. That's scary. I did not calculate that. Um, thankfully it's not terrible. It's not particularly good. should have played one more defensive move before doing this. Okay, we're just going to keep running and pretend that didn't happen. Oh, nicely done. All right. So how do I win this? Like this, right? No, not like that. Just kidding. Um, just kidding. Holy moly, we beat a master. We got lucky. Okay, well, um, that's my best accomplishment ever in this game. Um, I guess I'd like to thank everybody for watching. Uh, yeah, we're going to dedicate that win to Mango Town Plaza, because... He was the guy who was watching this with us, so got to dedicate this to someone. Why not dedicate it to our most loyal fan? That was exciting, though. Um, 
Yeah, I, th- I assume he was just rushing a bit, trying to up his stance in the standings, and or could have been distracted in some way. Uh, but I'll take it. I will very much take that, because I don't think... It, it can only go downhill from there, honestly. Yeah! Um, you see all this beautiful confetti? I still remember the days uh, where that would cause some streamers' PCs to like melt down. And I submitted a tweak and um, improved the performance of the confetti by like 10%. With just like a couple lines of code changes. It was beautiful. Uh, but yeah. Thanks to everybody for playing. Thanks to, um, I think it's Rope Stup, however you pronounce this, this fellow, for putting together leadrafts.org. Um, yeah, kudos to him for doing that. Um, so I hope you all enjoyed. Uh, it's very nice that I actually won a couple games today. Um, I should practice international drafts, though, because like, this stuff is super challenging. But yeah, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.